this Rashard Brooks story, this Rashard Brooks video, this is not what happened to Floyd up in, in, up in Minneapolis. This is not an extended video of a cop choking a guy out to death with a knee on the back of his neck. This is a violent confrontation at night with somebody pointing a deadly weapon at a cop. Those are apples and oranges because the color of the dead man is the same doesn't mean the cases are the same. Stop acting like complicated issues are simple. They're not. Now, time for the ultimate disclaimer. You know I don't like disclaimers. I don't put them on when I say something, but I do put them on when I'm about to show a video. I'm not sure I want your kids to see. I know you sit down and watch this with your kids. We don't do any dirty stuff on the show. I'm aware that you watch with your kids. I love that you watch with your kids. I'm always going to do a family-friendly show here. However, when there's something violent, especially something involving the death of somebody, I like to let you know. So... If your kids are not ready for this Richard Brooks incident, it's not overly gory, but it's what happened. Have them close their eyes for a minute or so. Here's what actually happened. All right, I think you've had too much to drink to be dry. Put your hands behind your back for me. Yeah, put your hands behind your back. Hey, hey, stop fighting. Stop fighting. Stop fighting. Stop fighting! You're gonna get tased! You're gonna get tased! You're gonna get tased! Stop! Stop! You're gonna get tased! Hey! Stop! Stop fighting! 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 Ugly. I think you had to see it. Ugly. But remember, I'm not Mr. Pro Cop in all scenarios. Well, I was crushing that cop in Minneapolis and still do. What are they supposed to do? They're handcuffing the man. He decides, for whatever reason, he doesn't want to go, wrestles with him, cop loses a hold of his taser. What are they supposed to do? What would you do? We need police officers, right? Let's remember, before you armchair quarterback, before I armchair quarterback, these are deadly confrontations. And far more cops are killed every year in these kind of confrontations than cops kill other people. These are what actually happens. It's the middle of the night. It's you and a partner. You're trying to arrest somebody. You're all alone in a dark parking lot. He starts to fight and takes away your taser. I'm not saying every shooting's perfect. I'm not saying this one's perfect. I would never say all cops are perfect. There are, of course, some scummy ones out there. That's just the nature of the beast. But let's remember, before we armchair quarterback, what they actually go through. That is not a scenario I would wish on anybody. And you're making split-second life-or-death decisions hoping you get home to see the wife and kids again. Remember that. Hey, thanks so much for watching the first on YouTube. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and like and subscribe. You heard me, like it, subscribe. You'll get a lot more of it and a lot more of me.